ladies are away, the boys will play. Anything can happen. It's gonna get crazy. Don't get the dragon! I got a brand new bikini, so drinks at the pool are on these. I got a sexy new tube top that says, come hither, and a can of pepper spray that says, close enough, Jack. I got some old underwear I'm gonna throw on stage at the Garth Brooks concert. I'm sorry, why old? Because last time I saw him, I threw new ones, and it got me nothing. I've got a brand new seven-piece set of polyhedral dice. Hello, new dice smell. I've got my helm of lordly might, my boots of speed, and if things get too exciting, my inhaler of asthma. <laughs> I got my new bloodthirsty savage warrior who will lay waste to all who stand before him. And I had a sensible salad for lunch, so I can eat all the pizza I want. <laughs> chatting like a bunch of teenage girls or are we gonna play D&D like a bunch of teenage boys who are never gonna have sex with those teenage girls? <laughs> Vegas! 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 The dungeon of Mavuska Higo! The dungeon of Mavuska Higo! The dungeon of Mavuska Higo! <laughs> okay, here we go. You find yourselves in an overgrown old forest and before you is a, a giant oak tree with a face on it that looks a lot like Nicolas Cage. He says, travel with caution. These woods are home to the bones of many a fallen hero. Honestly, Howard's just as good a dungeon master as I am. As good? Well, you just got pantsed in the schoolyard, Four Eyes. <laughs> hey, come on, guys, focus. Um, uh, oh, mighty Nicholas Cage tree. We thank you for your warning, but we are brave warriors, and nothing short of death will keep us from our goal. <laughs> oh, Lucy's tree after all. See ya. <laughs> Hey, hey, you can't leave. We just started. You're right. I should finish the game. I take my plus one long sword, stab myself in the face with it. I'm dead. I've got a date with a girl. Bye. We'll be fine. Watch. <clears throat> Suddenly, a spectral shape rises from Kuthra Polly's bloody corpse and says, Don't worry, buddies. Ghost Raj will help guide you through the forest. <laughs> Well, I'm just a tree, but if I were you, I'd listen to your ghost friend! <laughs> Go on, give him your lunch money. <laughs> I'll leave it up to the dungeon master. A satanic fungus that looks suspiciously like Al Pacino <laughs> rises from the forest floor and says, you're playing D&D. <laughs> You're playing D&D. This whole apartment <laughs> is playing D&D. <laughs> the dragon falls from the sky, crashing into the volcano. Ah! <laughs> Wait. He's not dead. He crawls out spreads his wings and prepares to attack. Get away, get away! <laughs> Doesn't he say something first? You know, maybe in the voice of a beloved celebrity? <laughs> Fine. You'd think, after all these years, I'd know not to fly over volcanoes. <laughs> I'm a freaking idiot. <laughs> Christopher Walken, that's perfect. <laughs> All right, Amy, it's your turn. We need one more hit. Finish him off. Here we go. 15? It's a hit. The dragon collapses to the ground. Oh, oh, no, wait, wait. And says... <laughs> Mother, is that you? <laughs> your little boy is coming home. <laughs> Oh, I don't know about you guys, but I've been through the emotional ringer tonight. 